And on number 11 I have a song that's not in English and it's probably, not probably, and it is my favorite Estonian entry ever, Urban Symphony with Rondayad. So for all of you that were complaining that my songs are only from after 2010, you see this one is before 2010, it's 2009, <laughs> much better. Here we go with Rondayad. Urban Symphony. I have to say that the very first word she's saying sounds like a very bad word in my language. That grabs my attention. Also the staging from 2005, I mean the stage itself, where like the screens moving, that, that's really helpful for this act. To have the reveal. Her voice is like so clear and the instruments are very good too. I also love the sound of the language in this song. I love those harsh R's. The I like this part, I don't know any of the words. But usually I do sing along, I'm just mumbling stuff. She's so beautiful. It's obviously something about stars, sky, universe. This part is good. That last flip on the note, that's so awesome. This could be easily be in a movie. Game of Thrones. A little bit of Aurora Borealis also. I like the constellations also. like her face. She looks like such a nice person. I'm not sure if it, it is like that, but at least on stage, she seems like a really, really nice person. She has like that kind of shy smile and stuff. I like that. I like when uh, people like feel vulnerable. They're not like so overconfident. Confidence many times in Eurovision is actually ruining an act. I'm not sure if you guys feel the same, but I've noticed that with me when I'm watching like some performances and I feel like the guy or the girl, they're like just getting very cocky and they just know that they're like so good and they just like, I don't know, they give you that feeling of overconfidence. It, it just ruins it for me. But when you see someone is like smiling so shy and she's like, ooh, I like that. Anyways, on we move to the top 10.